Hello, this is a um, caddy swap that I did uh, in paper art swaps, I think it's called in Facebook. Um, my swap partner is one of the admins, Lori. Uh, I already sent her hers and this is the one that she sent me. So I'm gonna go ahead and open it. And as you can see, it's well protected. Oh, wow. The color scheme is amazing. I'm going to go ahead and try and get all these out here. Okay. So I'll start on the sides. Oh, wow. This um, bubble mailer is gorgeous. Okay, these are the things that I won from her in a uh, giveaway. Hold on. Okay, first I just want to say that this is really pretty. I haven't, I've never seen this pattern on a uh, bubble miller before. So I'll definitely be reusing that. These are some of the things I won. Um, we do, she, or she does lives and they give away the admins, a couple of them get together and they give away different things um, and they have little games and it's fun. Um, I'll, I'll link the group down below if you want to check the group out. It's really fun. Um, so here are some dies and stamps. And then um, she must have thrown this in as extra. Okay. I'm going to set this aside. And then see. Oh. Oh, yeah. And she said she was going to make me some of these. Um, she has a die for these. And she sent me a picture of how she does them. They turn out really gorgeous. So I'll put some together and uh, I'll post a picture on my uh, crafty Instagram, which I'll also link below if you want to check those out. Or if you want to check Lori's, I'll put hers down below, uh, her Instagram. All right. Put them back in there so they don't get messed up. These are gorgeous. All right. And then we have this bag on the side here. It says Santa stop here. This bag's definitely going to get reused. Wow. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to set the box back just a little bit. Okay. So there's all kinds of treats in here. And I can tell you right now, some of these are going to go to my son. Like this. He's going to enjoy that. He loves ring pops. And then we got some coins, chocolate coins. He has a little candy, um candy bowl and anytime I get candy in a swap or if I have like if, if I'm able to get candy while I'm out I'll throw it in the bowl and every once in a while he'll go grab a piece out of the bowl uh light bulb lolly see I'm I'm starting to wonder if this is for my son I didn't see maybe there's a card I should have and it looks like one of the boxes fell out yeah when I got this box it was actually upside down um, so luckily these were in here because otherwise everything would have spilled out. Okay. Oh, wow. That's cute. It's a little new. I like that. And I like the colors too. Oh, wow. <laughs> uh, Warheads. I love sour stuff, actually. Um, this is extremely sour. Um, it has all kinds of different, I don't know if you can see, it's got like the push-up pop and um, some gummies in there and all kinds of stuff. Uh, the sour spray. So, um, I will be eating some of this, but I will also be sharing this with my son as well. This is really cute. I'm definitely going to be reusing that. So, I want to set all this over here so that I have room for the caddy. Oh, oh, this out. I think something fell. Okay. Yeah. See, this box right here came out, and I think a pen. A pen came out because here's a pen back. So I'll figure out where that goes. Um, but yeah, this box right here came out um, of this right here. So before I go digging in it, I want to show you that caddy itself. So I'm going to go ahead and put it back. Uh oh. Not to go back. Oh, there's something in there. That's why. That's probably what I heard fall. There. Okay. So look at how gorgeous this caddy is. 
And I honestly had never seen anything like this. And they posted it in the group um, as a group swap. And they also posted like the tutorial. Um, I'll post that below too, the tutorial to make these. Um, you can make these in anything. Like I made my pen pal one in her favorite colors. It wasn't Christmas related at all. Or you can make like a Valentine's one. It doesn't have to be Christmas. But it's a really cool idea to send somebody in a swap and it's something that can be reused over and over. So I really enjoy this group. It's given me a whole bunch of inspiration. But anyways, hers is completely gorgeous. I love these little bows on here. So pretty. And I love the colors that she used. Okay, so we'll do the boxes first. Well first, since this came out, um, I don't know where it was originally. Um, but, oh, you know what? I found out where that back goes, though. It came off of the, she used pens. Oh, how clever. I just noticed that. Wow, I'm slow. She used pens for her caddy uh, thing here. See, I used brads, I think. <laughs> I used brads, and I had it on the outside. So, I, I like the way she did that. That's very clever. Okay, and then we have this little uh, ice skate. Um, I'm actually, I think I'm going to give this to my niece because it's so shiny and everything. I think she'll really enjoy it. I think I'm going to give that to my niece just to see the smile on her face. Okay, so we'll do the boxes first. I'll start here. So we got some felt tees. Get these strings up out of the way. Okay, we got some felt tees. I think she handmade these. Very, very cute. Got a Santa Claus here. These. There. And this one. Just trying to get the glue strings out of the way here. These are really, really cute. Another Santa Claus. And these can be used in crafts or you can make an ornament out of them or whatever. Um, I think, hold on, this one might, I think this one's a sticker right here. And then some of them have like a little dot on the back. So that's very, very cute. So there's a box one. Next one. Oh, wow. What is this? I think, wait, are these supposed to be attached? Or are they tangled? I think they're tangled. Yeah, they're tangled. These are adorable. So these are some um, clips and they got, they all got charms on them. Wow. That is so cool and clever. I never thought to do that. See, I usually use these kind of clips for like my chips and stuff, but now, now with these charms on here, I think these would be cute on like a, a planner or a journal. These are adorable. And I know it takes a real a long time to do these kind of things. So the fact that she did three of them, put them in there. That is gorgeous. Thank you, Lori. Okay, let's see. I'm trying to get the clothes there. Put that over there. I'm just going to keep going around this way. So got a little box here. Oh, if I don't drop it. Wow. What are these? These are gorgeous. These are sewn. So she like handmade these and sewed them. I don't know if you can see the material. They're, it's like a, a leather material. And then the back's felt. These are gorgeous. Look at this. <sighs> Sweater weather. That's cute. And you know, one thing you can do with these, um, if you want to send one to somebody in a swap, is you could put them on a clip, like a paper clip. Or you could even take two of them and put them back to back on a paper clip. That way, no matter which way you turn it, there's something there. Or you can just attach them to a card or a project like this. Believe. These are gorgeous. And I see, I don't have anything to sew with. I don't have the sewing machine or things. So I can't do anything like this. So getting these 
as, as getting something that I wouldn't be able to do myself. Wow, I really, really love that. See, most of my style is like black, gothic kind of stuff, but every once in a while, I love some buffalo plaid. <laughs> I don't know what it is, I don't know, but, oh wow, look at this like holographic, that's cute. And then this little gingerbread person, that is cute. Oh, don't mind my nails. They've been like that for a while. I need to redo them. Okay. Next sacks. Okay, this is the one that fell out earlier. These are so gorgeous. Okay. These are made of material, not paper. And they're so, like, thick and layered. Like, even when I do the material ones, I can't get them this thick. I don't know what it is. Maybe I just don't have the right material. But I know that it's really hard to, um, like, die cut these kind of things out. So, I appreciate the hard work that you put in these. And look at that buffalo plaid one. Well, it's just regular plaid, not buffalo. But Oh, wow. Now, see, that's really cool, too. I've never seen anybody do that before. She put the this bow over the back bow and it has a little thing cut out of it that is so cute you guys are so the the people in this group are so creative and nice if you are looking for a swap group i highly recommend that one if you join any like i run my own swap group and um well let's just say it ain't nothing like hers because we only have about two people that participate. Okay. There. That is so pretty. I love the, um, what do you call them? Like metallic beads up here. And the little bow charm. That's so cute. Oh, oh, oh. oh my goodness. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> I sent her some Lindors too. Which ones are these? Are these just wrapped in a different paper? Are these the peppermints? I'm going to find out. I won't eat it right now, but I'm going to eat it right after. Oh, wait. Wait a minute. Oh, it's the peppermint, but it's chocolate. I haven't seen these. I've seen the white chocolate. I love these ones because I love the peppermint chocolates, but I've never seen the actual milk chocolate peppermint ones. That is so cool. Thank you for sending me those because I actually haven't tried those yet. Okay, so now let's dig into the uh, middle part here. So we have a candy cane here that my son will be enjoying. Add that to the candy pile. And then we have this uh, beautiful little mix here. It says reindeer dust, I love that. That's so cute. And I love that she taped it because uh, I know how hard it is to keep these things in there. Oh, you know what? I think this is probably tied to it. Charlotte, thank you for support. Oh, so for swapping with me, sorry, can't read. <laughs> oh, that is pretty. Merry Christmas. That's really pretty. I'm gonna figure out something to do with that because I put like creepy stuff on my tree. But you know what? I might hang that on my um, um, my dad's tree because I, I actually have to put it up every year because he's not able to. Uh, he's not able to do much anymore on his legs. So I, I might put that on his tree. I think he'll enjoy that. Thank you so much. This is gorgeous. Oh my goodness. I had this on my wish list and I told her that I'd always wanted one. And she even made it in like a theme that I would like. So this is a pokey tool. Oh my goodness. Thank you so much. I cannot wait to use this. My first pokey tool. I've actually never had one before. I've seen lots of people with them. Very, very pretty. Can't wait to use that. All right, 
And then we have the little stick that she stuck in there for decoration. Just gonna reach in and, oh, maybe not. <laughs> I think these are rags or towels, I can't tell yet. But I have trouble getting them out. I don't wanna mess the box up. Ah, how'd you get these in here? She must have put them in there. She cheated. She put them in there before she put the handle in there, didn't you? Didn't you? All right. So we have some kitchen towels. Never heard of this. Nic Nicole's Kitchen Homemade Goods. Never heard of that brand. These are like really heavy duty. I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna take these over my dad's too for the holidays. That is so nice. These are like really like high quality material. And look at the little gingerbread people and things. That's so cute. I can't tell, okay. I didn't think that this had a picture on it, but I wanted to make sure that if it did, I showed it, okay. This was an awesome swap. Let me make sure I got everything. <laughs> okay. This was an awesome swap and she definitely killed it. Thank you so much. Your caddy to begin with is amazingly gorgeous. And then you sent all this amazing stuff with it. Thank you so much, Lori, for having me in your group and for swapping with me. Thank you everybody for watching and I will catch you next time. Bye for now.